Hey guys, so this here bringing you another game of TFT Ranked. Uh, now, just before the game begins, the reason why I'm starting here is I just want to give a quick shout out to my second channel. So a lot of you may not know I've got a second channel, but I do. Uh, it's called Huzzy Extra. It'll be linked down below and all that stuff. And as you can see, we're doing a RimWorld series um, that we, we're restarting. I did one playthrough. It didn't do very well because I was a bit rusty at the game. So we're doing another playthrough and uh, hopefully it'll go better. So yeah, feel free to go check that out. That is also where any like car news, you know, I'm getting the new car, hopefully within the next like month and a half, um, we'll be doing a review and stuff of that car and the car vlogs, anything gym related. It all goes on that channel, um, separate to this channel. Um, a while ago, we did Huzzy updates on this channel, but they obviously never performed that well. Um, and I was like, you know, sometimes just getting it off my chest is what I want to do. So it can just go on that channel. Anyway, welcome. Uh, you'll notice I picked myself up the new arena skin, uh, which you get from being a, I think it's like a level seven or something reward uh, for the PBE pass. I just, I literally logged in today, had a mission that I could claim and I managed to get this skin. I really like it. I actually think it's the, uh, well, naturally it's probably the nicest arena because it's the hardest one to get right now. Um, what I'm, oh my God. Sure. Okay. Again, if, if if you know if it's gonna give me noble right at the beginning of the game, I guess why not take it? Because a noble will get me through hopefully the early game without losing too much health. The dream will be in the next round if I could get another vein, a tier two vein early would be great. Imagine a tier two vein in the first PBE rounds with attack speed item with noble buff. That would be brilliant. But obviously that might be a little bit too much to ask. But we'll see. Uh, so as for actual strategy, not really sure what I'm going to go. Um, but yeah, right now, if you're wondering about rank, because obviously we did the placement games, this is maybe the first, this might be the first rank game that we're playing since the placements. Uh, I'm bronze three. It sounds so weird saying that. But yeah, I'm bronze three, so I've ranked up a little bit since the placements. Uh, unfortunately, I did lose a game. I came eighth place last night by no fault of my own. I promise you. Uh, basically, um, I was on my laptop in bed because i was like hey tft is a great game just maybe to play in bed uh, which it is um the game wouldn't load <laughs> um i was logged in on my laptop it's all fully updated and i was like right let's play and the game just was not loading i was like oh <laughs> this is a feels bad so i lost the game completely for free by no fault of my own and i think i lost like 20 lp because obviously i came eighth i was like oh what damn but yeah, we got all three noble buff online. Would love a tier two unit because you can see in the top left in the chat or, or not up here, two people have got Mordekaisers already. And uh, obviously we can keep an eye on what people get before the first. Hell yeah. Uh, we can, that's really nice. We can see what people get in the first PVP round. Uh, again. Okay. Um... I think I'm going to grab that. Again, Assassin, by the way, at the moment, if I'm not mistaken, has the highest win rate in the game. So you can see I might be thinking about Assassin already a little bit. But again, not committing to anything because that's what apparently bad players do is they commit to a strategy too early. Noble is just getting me through the early game. I actually wouldn't. If most people go Assassin, wouldn't Noble be okay versus that? Question mark? Because Noble gives you the armor buff. Okay, I should win this. Luckily, we didn't go up against somebody that had, um, you know, the tier 2 units. Did he just put that on the Lulu? I don't know. Again, our Garen's got Noble, so you're not killing him easily. And my Vayne has literally not been hit yet, which is lovely. Uh, we'll also make an announcement just very quickly about the second channel as well. Uh, a game that I know I'm going to be doing a playthrough of eventually... I've already played it once, but it will be Detroit Become Human. I've played it on the PlayStation 4, but it is making its way to PC sometime later this year. We will be doing a playthrough of that game later. Okay, we get a tier 2. Um, do I want to sell stuff? 1, 2, 3, 4. If I win the round, that will be 10, and I can make the money. I think yes, because I'm not going to go wild. Uh, may as well also put that on Garen. Um, if I get another, if I get another thingy, um, magic item, large rod, hey, hey. Um, Morello Nomicon possibly. Again, I've got to think, would I want Morello later on my assassins? I don't sure. So this guy's early XP'd. Oh, my vein got noble. Let's go. Uh, so this guy's early XP'd. 
which makes it a little bit interesting. His Trisana is also tier two, so I don't know if we're going to win this. We need to kill this Mordekaiser very fast. Yeah, again, we don't win this, unfortunately. The, the tier two Trist with Bloodthirster, I think, is a bit too much. And my front line honestly got a little bit destroyed. Um, so we weren't going to get the, uh, unfortunately, the interest. So we may as well buy all that just so we don't get it next round either. You have to remember, if you, I'm taking these, if someone wants a Darius, someone wants a Shen, it's also you're having them on your bench. So those people won't be finding them either. Uh, there is definitely part of that coming into play. Um, Like, I'm trying to think. Do I want to transition Noble into Assassin? Or do I want to go, like, Noble Pirate then into Assassin? I'm not really sure. I, I, you know, I think maybe keep Noble. Um, Let's put him out. I think Darius might be better than Maud. He has 100 more health. Uh, let's sell the Kassadin so we're just easily on 10 interest. Hopefully we win this round, though. Tier 2 Kassadin and a... Whoa. A Death Cap already on a Twisted Fate. Is that really who you want a Death Cap on? I don't. I wouldn't put a Death Cap on a Twisted Fate. The, not enough damage output to warrant that, in my opinion. Alright, this is looking good. They are literally not killing my Darius at all. Okay, lo lovely. Um, so I'm actually pretty happy with my positioning here. We're in mid of the table, so we haven't lost too much health. Um, so yeah, we're in well, we're in fifth. So I have I do have a little bit more priority than these people on the carousel, but I'm not right at the bottom, which is great. Um, literally no assassins at all, but that's fine. Again, apparently you're supposed to go for items on carousel, not really thingies. Uh, I'm tempted to go for Volibear. Hear me out. What if I made Volibear an assassin? Or do I just take the spatula? I'm just going to take the spatula, actually. Again, maybe to get to the six. Or, oh, hmm. I'm trying to think what I want to do. I should probably scout people and see what they're going to do. I've never done six knight before. Literally, I've never done it. Do we do six knight? Just for fun. I'm ten. Ooh, does that two Garens? Hell yeah. That's nice. I'm really tempted to do two knights. Should I do two? Shall I, uh, six knights? Sell him. Because that's a knight. What does that make? Glacial. Okay, I don't want... Oh, I could... Ooh, I could do a knight glacial? Knight glacial would go quite well. Because it's got the Sejuani combo. The but then how do you get six knights and six... You can't get all of it, can you? No. Oh, snap. Tier two more, tier two. Three tier twos. I've got two tier twos. As long as they don't go on my vein, I think I might be okay. Who got the noble buff? Garen. Okay, he's going to take an eternity to kill. Damn, Darius unfortunately didn't get his heal off. But yeah, look at my Garen. He's just not dying. Good old Garen boy. Getting him tier two. Fiora, come on. There we go. She was like bugged for her like half a second at least. Good. That guy had 100% eight. Look at the damage dealt, man. Crazy. I'm gonna buy it. I don't, I'm not gonna commit to that because I want to keep the 20. I need more mords, I guess. But it, the, the only main issue in my head is that people do have already two Mordekaisers. There should be plenty of them because he's a one-cost unit. So there's over, I think, 30 of them or something crazy. Um, again, I'm not committing tonight, by the way, because that's what that's what a bad player would do. It'd be like, I'm doing this, and then you don't get it. So again, I, I probably should buy this Zed just in case the knight's not going to work, and then I want to go assassin anyway. So this guy is going knight. Very similar to me, but he hasn't got noble buff. He's got three knights and a vein, but his vein is tier two. Mine isn't. Who's got noble? Uh, I'm guessing my Vayne has Noble because I don't see who's got it. Oh no, my Fiora's got it. That might be okay. Come on, Vayne, ramp up and kill that Garen. And then both of you can kill that Vayne. Cool. Get your pat spell. Okay, cool. Nice. Beating these people is nice. I like this. I like it. I like it. I like it. Again, top four is what we're aiming for. Obviously, we'd love to get first. Darius. Noxus will rise. Do we want that Kha'Zix? Or do we want that... I'm thinking, like, do I want... If I went for, like, two Glacial... 
Nah, because the thing is, I think I probably want to use that spatula to make a knight unit, right? I don't think I want to make a glacial unit. Because it's going to be harder to get all the knights. Because what, I need Sedge, Leona, I think. Uh, Kale, that's going to be hard to get. I guess we can sell Shen and maybe pick up the Kazakhs instead. Again, I'm still kind of thinking Assassin as like, just in case. Am I thinking Assassin just in case? Again, I've done Assassin. Assa there's so many people doing Assassin. Like, I'm even thinking, I know you probably shouldn't. I should be thinking, whoa. I should be thinking about ranking up. But like, I'm still making a video that you guys want to watch. And so many people are doing Assassins at the moment. That it probably is a little bit boring. So that's what I'm kind of thinking. Do we just go Knight? The only issue with Knight is the damage output later probably is pretty bad. Wow, we're really not getting this vein, huh? We're one vein away. Do I... Again, I've got some nice foundation for my assassins. No tier 2s, but the foundation's there. <sighs> I'm going to sell that to Sandra, just so I get over to the 40. I think Knight is what? Spatula Chain Vest? Yeah. And I'm not getting that. Right now we're sitting in tied second. Oh yeah, really tied second. There's, there's three-way tied a second. We're against a guy that is tied in second. Wild. My Darius got Noble, which isn't probably the best because he's still tier one. Oh, that Warwick didn't get stunned. Okay, we just need this. We need to survive and no one is literally touching my Darius. Um, sorry, Vayne. But I'm a little bit worried that the Vayne, because she's only tier 1, her damage output isn't crazy right now. But Darius with Noble buff can survive a long time. And the, the Ginsu you can see, with, and he's healing. So yeah, I think we'll win. Because the, 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 the attack speed is finally ramped up on the Vayne, and the Darius can't really die. Noble Darius is actually not bad. Imagine if he was tier 2. And he's just tier 1. So yeah, great. A lot of damage output by Vayne because literally she was untouched. I need him at level 2. I need the Vayne at level 2. Okay, we get one of them. And I'm already... By the way, we're already at 50 eco. We have ecoed really well this game. Like, randomly. So, we're doing okay. We just need... I'd really like the Vayne to be tier 2. And we need some Mordekaisers because I'm, I'm... We need tier 2 knights. Oh, I can put an extra unit out. Um... I'm thinking I just put Pike out to be annoying. I can't get any more synergies. If it was a synergy to get an extra knight, then I would have put it out. I can't. And Pike just can be a little bit annoying with his stun, is what I'm thinking. All right, Garen got it. Pike is on my Garen. Feels bad for that guy, because you're not going to kill him very fast. Okay, Pike, come on. All the way through. Stun the Tristana, stun the Darius. Come on, lads. All right, and then we're on these two. Spin and Darius do yours. Nice. Nice. Oh, look at my veins health. <laughs> cool. It's going well. I wonder what this guy's got. Kind of interested. Oh, is that the synergy I do with Glacial? Because Volley Bear is known as the strongest unit in the game right now. Okay, we finally got it. Hell yeah. I'm thinking I go Volley Bear with then the Sejuani. That might be better. Okay, I'm committing. People are going to be angry at me, but I'm committing to this. I don't want the Fiora. Again, remember, I know people... It's funny in the comments going, You could have had a tier million Fiora by now. Remember, when you're re-rolling, that same Fiora could just be coming up. It's not guaranteed it's a different Fiora every single time. Again, I hate passing up a Draven. It just feels bad because Draven is such a good unit, but whatever. All right. I'm, I'm pretty happy with how this is going. So we're on a six win streak. My Fiora actually did a lot of DPS that game. Okay, it's, it's wanting me to get Fiora. Um, we want that Leona. Straight up. Or the Sedge. Okay, there's two options. Or the Poppy. Poppy kind of sucks, but it's those three. Okay, we don't get that. I know technically I shouldn't... Oh, do I not go for one of them then? Do I go for a chain vest? Because people keep telling me, don't go for champions in the carousel. Go for items. 
Well, considering both of my options have gone, I guess we're going for a chain vest. And I'll go for the kindred. Because that's the most money. Alright, so we can make something else a knight. So now it's worth... I think I'm going to make Volibear a knight. Because again, he's just the strongest unit in the game right now. Um, so that is correct. Yes. So that's a knight. I've got so much money. Because I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the vein a little bit because like vein is just a strong vein is just a strong unit right now. Hell yeah, let's go. I'm actually gonna do this. I'm gonna keep my Fiora back just in case someone has an assassin. Because then you what you're jumping on a Fiora, not my vein. Oh look, it might have worked. Jump on my Fiora. Oh god, they went on my vein. <laughs> Alright, so here's redemption. Oh, look how look how much the Shen is taking up these three's time. I think we're fine, maybe, when the volley bear pops off. Come on, volley bear, pop off. There he is. There he goes. And now they're not gonna kill the Darius or Garen. There's no way. Oh, is there a way? Boom! Nope. Let's go. Right, maybe I should be looking. Maybe I should be up XPing here. Okay, we'll grab that. But yeah, I think we're gonna start just aggressively XPing because boom, Mordecai's is in, even though he kind of is only tier one. But boom, four knight. So they are they are blocking forty damage every single auto attack, um, which it does. It's not that good. Uh, but assassin comps. You know, and all of these are tanky boys too. So it's like assassin comp and tanky boys. Actually, let's swap that so Fiora's a little bit more in the action. I don't care if the Mordekaiser dies right now because he's tier one. Okay, we... This guy is very low. So he's doing an... He's doing a glacial comp. Interesting. So he's got Hush on his Ash. The silence item. A lot of freezing is going on. But look how tanky my, my guys are. Like, the Mord's gonna die because he's tier one. But, like, no one else is dying. Maud might not even die. Okay, he dies for the Lissandra, but wow. Like, is he out? Oh my god, we nearly knocked that guy out. Wow. Okay, we got another tier 2 Darius. Okay. Knight. I don't know if I need the Poppy. I've heard mixed things. I've heard. Wow. I've heard mixed things about Poppy that she might not be very good, but she might be better than Maud. And the chance, like, again, we know other people have got Maud in this game, so maybe I'm not going to get a, a big Maud. So maybe it's a bigger chance getting a bigger Poppy. And technically, again, he's a one cost unit, she's a three cost unit. So she should be better. Should. Um, now this should be relatively easy for this type of comp. All these wolves do is auto attack and I'm blo blocking their auto attacks. So I could do that, which I'm going to do, because that gives Garen a big... That's Garen big boy damage now. Um... Boom, we found it. That's worth that, because that gives us the glacial bonus. And now I want Sejuani more involved. We're going to put mana on the Sejuani too, so she can get that off quicker. This is going pretty well. I don't know why I've got that random pike. Let's do one more reroll, and we get him. This is going pretty good. Again, I don't know if I fall off. I, don't, I might, might fall off. The crazy thing as well, by the way, I wouldn't mind another knight item um, to make something a knight. I'm half tempted to make my vein a knight. You know, because I'm I'm on my way. I'm one vein away from a tier three vein, by the way. So is that a bad idea to make a my vein a knight? I don't think so. All right, Garen hasn't even spun. Look at Garen's damage output. Oh, umbrella not a con, dude. Does so much damage. And look at the difference. I beat him. He's no any no eco. I've got fifty eco. I'm laughing to the bank right now. This is great. We're in a great position. It does kind of feel like I made the right... Oh, wait. She's not a knight. Oh. I thought she was a knight. Oh, uh, what do I sell for him? I'm going to sell the Garen. That might have been a mistake, but... Oh, my days. What do I sell for her? 
How many have I got? I've got four. Putting her in would be five. What's my Maud? Maud's only tier one. Okay, screw Maud. Screw Maud. Alright, what's this guy? He's near the bottom, but he's actually doing a lot of damage to me. A lot of damage. Get that Sedjo off. Okay, the Sedjo. Oh, my God. Two tier twos in the back line. Just straight up killed me. Okay. Interesting. I think my Vayne got killed pretty early there. That's fine. Again, we haven't lost in quite a while. That's a, it's a shame we lost that because we went to 49 gold. So I now don't make the income from the interest. Like the full interest. Oh my god. Is it legitimately going to give me a tier 3 volley bear? <laughs> that would be crazy. I'd love it if it did. I'm doing one. Oh my dude. Didn't like when you see a legendary unit, you're like, ah! <laughs> you're like, I don't need it. I don't need it right now. It sucks. Mm -hmm. I need that kale. That's what I'm after. Oh, I'm against a ghost unit. Okay, so to explain the ghost units, because again, in the comment section, in this would have been a few days ago. Um, but a guy was like, "Why are you happy about ghost units? I see it as a bad thing." Ghost units is a free round. Like, yes, you're not taking health from people, but you're not losing health. Uh, if you lose to a ghost round, you're very much behind. How ghost rounds work is the, they, the, the hero, the champions on the enemy team have their items, but no synergy. So let's say they've got six sorcerers. They don't have that bonus at all. That bonus does not exist. So we want that Kale um, or the Volley Bear. But yeah, that, that's why you're happy about ghosts. You're, you're given a free round. It's amazing. Okay, both of our what we wanted has gone. And Nivea would, I would like, because then again, I can make maybe the Vayne a knight. Um, if not, the Garen for the chain vest for eventually if we get another spatula. Or the Draven, I guess. Uh, Leona had RFC. No one took RFC. So yeah, the Nivea is what I want, but I doubt I'm going to get it. Wow, I'm actually going to get it. Okay, cool. Could have gone for the Garen, obviously, as well, but I don't think I've got any room on my bench, so I may as well just sell the Olivia quick, get the spatula, and then I'm, I can get another knight unit. Which I think is worth. Oh my god. Oh my god, what do I do? I guess I sell that. And then Poppy. I, I can't prioritize that yet. I just sold that. that. That's probably the thing that I just sold. It keeps popping up. Oh, dude. Imagine if a volley bear just popped up. I, I that, Another guy did take volley bear on the carousel. So it's like, you know, does he is he going for volley bear too? And volley bear is a three cost unit, I think. So, you know, less of them are going to be around. Now, this is a comp that knight should be good against, by the way. Relatively. Uh, in before we lose, but yeah, because he's pretty much all physical damage. He's got just all physical damage, and I'm blocking all of his auto attacks. So, yeah, we beat him convincingly. See, like, the volley bear strength. Imagine a tier 3 volley bear! <laughs> We're one volley bear away! <laughs> Come on, dude. Stop giving me that. Oh! That's good. I guess we'll pick it up. We've got room now. Give me the bear. I could just roll down right now, but that would be bad. I've got to be patient. I've got to be patient, man. What does that give? Demon. Hmm. I've got to be patient. I'm winning rounds. We're first on health, so let's not ruin my interest uh, and all my eco for the sake of maybe finding a volley bear. So this guy's doing... It seems a little bit... Oh, wait. Has he got six noble? No, guardian buff. I was like, what? That was the guardian buff proking. It just looked like noble. So his Garen is quite scary. His has got Morello, like mine's got, but also red buff. So I don't know if I'm winning this round. This is the guy that's in second place. Go on, Volley Bear. We need him to, like, kill everything for me. So his Leona's got an RFC, which is a bit weird. Garen, get in there with your... Get in there. Get in there with Morello. Why are you so stunned? Wow, he was so stunned for, like, a million years. I don't even know if that was a bug. He just stood there. Wow, okay. Because it I know like Ash Arrow could have been hitting him, but it didn't look like it was on him. Okay, that's nice. Come on, Volley Bear, dude. 
Yes! <laughs> There's another one there. Like, part of me is like, do I buy that one just to deny it from others? Uh, what we're hoping here, by the way, is a chain vest. I want to make my vein a knight. Because one, it makes her tankier. And two, I can keep her in and she's tier three. Um, I don't know if it's the right call, but yeah. And then all we need to then is upgrade, put the poppy in until we get Kale. And then, yeah, we're good. We're, I'm keeping the noble three for now. All right, come on, chain vest. Or a force of nature, I guess, might not be terrible. Because then I can just get it anyway. Okay, one item. <laughs> it's like the game is this. Oh, we would have got it any. Oh my god. All right, let's make Vayne into a knight. Wow. The game was like legit listening to me. Like, I need this. Okay. I guess we'll get the mod. All right, so... Yeah, I don't think I'm going to replace the noble yet. Because I, I I don't know. Maybe I could go for noble six and knight. But may, yeah, maybe. May, in order to do that, maybe I would have needed to make the volley bear... Maybe put the volleyball not as a knight, though. I don't know. Okay, this guy. He's got a pretty tanky Garen. But this is the physical damage guy, so we should be relatively fine against him. Boom. My Darius just did deeps and healed quite a lot. Here's the Sejal. Really nice stun. Everything's going to die. My volleyball is just going to start wrecking. I'd like some more damage items on volleyball, if I'm honest. Because, yeah, volleyball's damage output is arguably going to be... <laughs> arguably going to be more than veins <laughs> a lot more than veins so let's try and get some more damage on this volley bear like attack speed and stuff so we're looking for darius really darius uh would then give us our tier three darius we're looking good it's just that guy here that makes me a bit nervous um, we're going to start buying XP and then put the poppy out, baby. Six noble, uh, six knight buff. I've never done this before. I've never got to six. All right, because again, let's make our weaker unit go at the back so she gets the assassin's attention. Again, the vein might, because when they walk forward, if they're over here, then they might jump behind the vein. It's possible. Uh, but then the poppy should help the vein instantly. I'm going to buy the Fiora because it's one cost and I may as well. We still haven't found the Kale, by the way. Maybe I need to just let... Oh, we're again... Why is it putting me against the guy that's in first? Ooh, that was a really nice dodge by my Fiora. Come on, Volley Bear. No. Oh, God, she's got Kindred. Come on, Volley! He's doing so much damage. Volley Bear! Ooh, this is going to be close. Oh, Ash Arrow. She got off! She got off! Yes! Yes! Oh! Yes! We beat the guy in first! Oh my god, that was so hype. Again, people say they don't get TMT. I know I'm not controlling what they do. It's just fun to watch. It's great. I was forged by hmm. Don't know if, if Mordecai's is really any good, but whatever. Okay. I'm just looking for that Kale. Because I'd probably replace Fiora with Kale. I think Fiora's kind of reached the limit of like how useful she is at this point. So yeah. Kale would be nice. Mm. Alright, we're against... Where's this guy? He is, he, we could knock this guy out. Oh wow, he's in third? Oh my god, I just noticed the health bars, everyone. Look. Oh my... These two are like, not doing anything. That's not great. Sedge. She's stunned. Get your ult. Oh, that's a good look at that ult. Look at that ult. Boom. Yeah, we knocked this guy out, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, the health bars are actually kind of crazy. That two of us are so far ahead of everybody else. Everyone else is going to be out. Like This is just going to be a 1v1 very soon. Huh. All right, Kale. But again, the is there even a Kale here? No. Uh, so we want... Ooh. Another spatula would give me a force of nature if I wanted it. But again, I am looking for maybe damage on the volley bear. So, a, you know, recurve bow, which is already gone. So, I don't know. Maybe another spatula. I get it if I want it. Do I want it? Yeah, I'm going to take another spatula just for another unit. 
I am so fat that I walked over. Wow. When you're really fat, everybody, you got to be careful that you don't accidentally bump into things. Are you serious? Oh my god. How did I do that? All right, I'm going to put that... Oh, that would be good. And let's swap that around. Just so maybe the redemption goes off. Oh, there was a mord there. Whoops. Yeah. I'm so focused on finding the kale that I missed a mord. Oops. My bad. I think I'm just going to start buying XP. All right, we're against this guy. Rip in peace. Again, he's the guy that's built physical damage against a knight comp. Oh my god, the volley bear got the noble buff too. Yeah, I think repositioning the sedge there was a good idea. Because boom. Instantly she gets her all off. And I think having sedge more... Oh my gosh, she got another one off. Here's the redemption. She lived! <laughs> so redemption got changed. It now activates at 25%, I think, of the champion's health that has it. Not on their death. Bye. Oh yeah, this game's going really well. I'm happy. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode, because I think it's been a pretty good one. Okay, I'm just going to start buying XP basically every round. I'm not going to ruin my econ right now, because literally there's no need. Um, I don't know if I beat the guy in second. I don't know if I beat this guy. Because he does have some scary things, and the kindred's annoying, and he's got phantom buff. If that phantom buff just goes on the wrong thing... Ugh. All right, who does it give me? It gives me the guy in last place. So he's got Locket. He's got a pretty strong Aurelian. I don't see this guy beating me. There's the Sedge ult instantly. Yeah, Aurelian's already dead. He's dead, this guy. So it's a 1v1. God, I, I this is the weirdest, I think, game I've played of TFT so far. There's a redemption. That makes everything apart from Sejuani full health. Um, because, yeah, I've never got to this stage of the game that it's just a 1v1. Everyone else is out already. Before the dragon, it's now a 1v1. That's really weird. And it's still not giving me... It's still not giving me it. So I get a Seraphs for killing this. I don't really know what I'd put Seraphs on. Um, maybe the Sejuani, just to keep her ultimate going and going and going all the time possibly uh, so this guy is building he's got us we're, we're a little he's got ranger knight it's he well no ranger knight guardian okay my volley bear keeps getting the noble passive honestly that's kind of who i want it on so there's the glacial finally kicking in yeah, I'm going to give this to Sedge. I think we might start rolling down a little bit, if I'm honest. Because, like, he doesn't have an assassin, does he? Nope. So you may as well position everything ready to go. Give me Kale. Oh my god. Like, there's a thingy. There's a thingy. Does Kale not exist? Alright, so this round, again, he's got no eco. I've got money to burn to find that Kale. Oh, my vein is the one that got phantomed. That actually might not be a bad thing, though. My Darius over on the left is doing nothing. The reason why that might not be bad is because they can't get to my vein. So my vein is actually not dying, even though she got phantomed and she's literally on 100 health. I think we're good. If a rogue Varus ultimate, by the way, hit the vein, I'd be very sad. Okay, like that. And then these two got redemption to full health. Ah, we're good. And again, if we find that Kale in the next few rotations... God, Folly Bear, dude. If we find that Kale... Easy GG. I think we're just going to start looking for it aggressively. It's not the... Not the legendaries! Not the legendaries! What is going on? I've never seen this. I know there's going to be people screaming at me going, Finally, dude. There we go. Finally! 
in before, that was a bad idea. I don't think it will be. All right, my Sedge got phantomed. Come on, Sedge! Yes, she got redemption and she's alive. Boom. Not terrible freeze. Oh, Volley Bear's in his back line. Volley Bear's in the back line. All right. Let's do it, baby. Uh, not the best Sejuani ultimate, though. Good, Garen. Look at that DPS. Look at that DPS. There we go. Uh-oh. We don't win that. Oh, do we? No, that was so... Okay, that was close. Man. That was pretty poop. Darius was like AFK for ages. Okay, we got to change our positioning here. So, let's change it up. Let's spread this a bit more. Oh, I could have put another unit in. I'm done. Is there anything else I would have wanted? Not really. Let's do that. Like we're gonna we're gonna like encompass him. Is there anything different? Like if I put him down, who's my other brawler? That's better. Makes the volley bear even stronger. Yeah. Volley bear's now got nearly three thousand health. And if we manage to get the Cho'gath knock up in its little corner, that could be quite good for us. He hasn't moved his positioning at all. We have. Okay, my volley bear got phantomed. Okay, that's bad. Sedge, get your ult off. Sedge. Stop being stunned. She is completely stun locked. Okay, she got it off. Redemption. Boom. I didn't actually do that much healing. Sedge got her ult off. Cho'gath has still not got his ult. Oh, not a good ult. Damn, dude. Are we not going to win? Phantom. Ugh. Okay, that round was really unfortunate because volley bear got phantomed. He's like our main carry. There has to be something positional. Like, again, Ranger, I did say, could potentially be falling off because the damage output. Okay, maybe putting Kale in was a mistake because she's not really doing what I need her to do. Maybe I'll maybe I'll take her out. Or I'll just get, an yeah, I'll just get another spatula. Okay. We'll get another spatula and then we can just put Thingy back in. We can just put Fiora back in and have an extra unit. Sure. Okay. Because I think our problem might be lack of range damage at this point. Um, Fiora or Maud? Or do we get an extra ranged unit in like Darius? Uh, Draven. Let's, Let's do, do it. This. Let's just get a random Draven just for more range damage. And the Imperial might carry the Draven through. Cool. That was good. That's good. Okay, let's see how this goes. Let's see. Draven get Imperial. Yes, Draven got the Imperial. Okay, Sejuani instantly got killed. She got the Phantom. This isn't looking too bad. Oh, God, that Varus, though. Eesh. Volley Bear get in his back line. This is looking good. This is looking good. Maybe that's what we needed. An extra range damage unit. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. He's saying GG because I think he now thinks it's over. Good. All we now really need is upgraded Draven. And I think, like, we win. So I'm not going to use Maud. I'm not prob... Like, I may as well actually look for that. Uh, Fiora. Don't care. Let's look for the da uh, Draven. Come on, buddy. One more. Damn. <laughs> Come on. One more. Damn. <laughs> Come on. No. We might have finally cracked it that we needed another range. Okay, who gets phantomed? Ka Draven gets phantomed. He gets killed. Ooh. Good Sejuani ultimate. Boom. Everything is frozen. Good knock up. Everything got knocked up. Come on, another Sejol. Yes, another Sejol. Boom, let's go. We've got it, boys. We've got it. Yeah. Again, even with Draven not being able to, like, attack, I think we've finally cracked it. Oh, Rift. Oh, my God, he's got a Ginsu. Because you don't get to Rift much, so I don't really know the positioning of Rift. I'm just going to do that. just not giving me that Draven, though. Obviously, more Kales would be nice, too, but I, just, I don't think that's ever going to happen. Ooh, what a game, dude. This is actually like... Oh, he's got a spear. 
That actually... Oh my god, Spear could make such a big difference from him. If he's smart, he'll put Spear on Kindred. If he's smart, he'll put Spear on Kindred. The more he's got Phantom buff. Okay, Drave... Oh god. I don't even know what Rift does. You hardly even see Rift. Can something stun it? There we go, Glacial. Knock up. Alright, we get it. Is he killing it? Oh, he killed it easy. Who do I give that to? Do I just give that to my Vayne? No, Volibear. Yeah. Draven. 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 Damn it. Draven. Draven. Oh my god, they just don't exist. He hasn't even got them, does he? No, he has got no Dravens right now. So he's repositioned. Wait, he just quit. He legit has just quit. I guess he's like, I've lost. So he's just leaving already. Really? Oh, he's... Oh, he's positioned to lose. Yeah, he's positioned to lose. He's opened up his back line. So I can just kill him really for free, I would guess. Uh, why'd he do that? Good knock up. Yeah, so yeah, he just positioned to lose. And I guess like we're going to do a lot of damage to him and he might actually get knocked out. Boom. Yeah, he positioned to lose and left. Wow, I've never, I've never seen someone do that. Like, he just knew he was beat at that point. Nice win, everybody. Let's see how much LP we get. So he came first. This is my first time coming first after the placements. So I don't know myself how much LP I gained. Oh, I got promoted instantly. Oh, wait, my camera is not on. Hello. Um, so I was in Bronze 3 and we just straight away just get promoted to Bronze 2. So I must have gained over 60 LP because I think I was Bronze 3 40 something LP. So I've gained over 60 LP. But yeah, really nice game. Hopefully you enjoyed this one. It was a pretty long one because obviously it's gone the whole way. But that was the first time I've ever done Knight. And it was great. Like, it worked. We made Volibear a Knight. He's the strongest unit in the game right now. We made Vayne a Knight, which is a bit weird but because she got Tier 3. And everything just worked really nice together. I do think getting the Draven at the end was a good call just for extra range damage because the guy was, like, packing his carries into the corner with a tank front line. So just, like, let the Draven do a bit more deeps. So, yeah, really nice. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash the like button again. Make sure you hit the like. Make sure you comment on these TFT videos. We want them to perform as well as possible. Uh, but, yeah, like, subscribe. See you guys next time. See ya.